Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. Last time we started our journey through the Forbidden Woods and we got ourselves a boomerang. We are so badass with our boomerang. Like just so insanely badass. It's also very useful too because you can target enemies and collectible items. So if something's out of your way, you know, just use your boomerang to track them down. Anyway, today we're going to finish this here dungeon. I kind of have to hurry up because, once again, I'm recording this before I have to go to work, and, uh, yeah. Also, if you use it on P-Hats, you cut off their little feathers, so, uh, I thought I was locked onto you. So, yeah, you don't have to worry about, uh, them ever growing back, then. Okay, yo, I, I want a feather off of you, so, uh... I guess I could have ain't... Oh my god. Why, why you no aim? Did I get the feather? Eh, whatever. I don't, I don't even know anymore. And you're falling down there. I don't ever have to deal with you. And one would think, oh, you want to drop those to, you know, throw at these. But no, you can just target those and then... Yeah. Boomerangs should not work like that. Oh, and, you know, while I'm at it. See what I said when it's overpowered? Like, this is not how boomerangs work, people. It, it just isn't. Just zig and zagging through the air. It's kind of ridiculous. You don't even need to target them in any order. It'll just track them down. Unless it hits a wall, of course, but you know. One of the pitfalls of a boomerang, I guess. How the hell do I get across from here? I kind of forgot. Wait, I, I can actually make this with the... Freaking pee hat! Never darken my doorstep with your face again. Oh, okay. I am, like, always just never 100% sure what jump I can make with my Deku Leaf. Like, ugh. Need to have more faith in it. Joy Pendant. Why? Well, whatever. Okay. So now we are up here. You might be thinking like, oh no, what are we going to do up here? Well, we're going to go ahead and equip our boomerang. And cut down that. So, I think for the most part I'm done with everything on these... Ah, uh, man, I left something in a room behind me. Oh, wow, I think I left a few things behind, actually. Uh, well, like I said, I'm going to be coming back here for the uh, Tingle statue anyway, so... Eh, I'll just leave those items behind. No, crap! Wrong button. I will not take fall damage. No Siri Bob. No Siri Bob. Thank you for not dying in the Death Water Link. That would not have been good. All right. This room. It's an interesting room. Well, I guess you could, you know, just. I, I need that feather. Oh crap, no, 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 feather! Ah, fine. But I guess you could jump up and take care of these enemies as normal, but it's best to just use your boomerang. Plus it does like collateral damage. It doesn't just kill like five things on each one. It can kill more, as boomerangs are known to do. But boomerangs aren't really known to kill things, you know, just, you know, stun them or, you know, give you a nasty bump on the head and, you know, annoy you mildly. I don't know, I, I never had an actual experience with a real boomerang. I mean, I had a toy boomerang before. Oh, crap. Oh, this isn't Death Water. Oh, that's nice. Okay. Yeah, I had a toy boomerang before. It never came back to me. You, you just threw it and it was like, uh, okay. Maybe I'm throwing it wrong. Also, these things. I forgot what their official names are called. I think Demi something. I like to call them the Evolved 
form of dead hands. Dead hands. Wow, that that is a weird sentence. I mean, it's grammatically correct. It's it just sounds weird. Dead hands, dead hands. Dead hands, dead hands. Huh. All right, but well, whatever. Okay, so new area. Wait, I can get this. I have the technology to jump. Yellow rupee. Not necessarily worth it. Alright, whatever. I forgot with this one. Do I want to do a spin attack or the the, the thing with the thing? Oh, crap, 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 crap! Okay, um. Am I about to drown here? Oh my god. Wow, um. Well, this sucks. Um, okay, well, this is what happens when you drown. Okay, let's try this again. This time, with the boomerang, because, uh, you know, that can happen. I want to be all cool and junk, you know, like, yeah, I'm using my spin attack effectively, yo. That was, like, so unbelievably rude, Octorok. Like, no, no. Pay for your sins. Freaking shooting me with a rock while I'm holding a bomb. Octorok. How dare you. Wait, but don't I go through? Uh, oh, well, fine. Let, let, let's go through here first. Oh, this room. Yeah, this this room is optional, if I remember correctly. But mm, might as well, because I think we can get a uh, hit by a Deku Baba or Boko Baba. I gotta get used to that. They're... Oh, they do regrow their wings, feathers, whatever. We grab this seed, okay. Wait, I want that! No! Okay. Oh, that would have been epic. Uh, but whatever. As you can see, combat is not going so well for me. Okay. Thank you. Holy shiza. All right. You're about to be, yep, a Boko Baba. And you guys, I just don't even want to deal with you ugly mugs right now. Thank you for that pointless uh, pickup there, Moomerang. I mean, I was going to move slightly to the left to pick it up myself, but whatever. That did not work out. Uh, I guess I could just do this. It's nothing major. Alrighty. Damn it! I forgot about that. Uh, I thought that was an actual bud that I could go into. Apparently it wasn't. There we go. Are you going to turn into a bug? Yes, you will. All right, cool. All righty. I forgot that I did, in fact, need to use my Deku Leaf. What is wrong with me today? I'm just playing awful. And yeah, I know there's this crawl space here, but trust me, you can't do anything with this just yet because, you know, you, you can't open that treasure chest. You just can't. It's impossible. Oh my god. Uh, okay, I actually made it up here for once. Holy crap. And uh, here we are. We feel that magic and...
All right. Because, yeah, if you recall, like when I was trying to go through that crawl space, there's a... Really? Really? You're, you're not hitting that, really? Oh, man. But, yeah, there, there's like a little seed thing that's on top of the... Uh... Oh, wait, I'm, I'm a freaking super genius. I can just do this. I am so stupid today! Oh yeah, you know, there's a seed on top of the chest. We can't get it, so, uh... We, we have to use the bomb. Okay, I'm sorry, this just looks... weirdly bombable for some reason. Okay, that was a waste of time. So I think I'm fine with just throwing it from right here. Yep, it goes down in there. And let's see if I can make it in! Yes! All that for a treasure chart. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, nah. But yeah, we can't get out of there, so, you know, we, we just go through here. Crouch and crawl through. Alright! Well, it took me ages to complete this optional room, but whatever. At least we did it. I don't have to worry about this when I come back for the Deku, not Deku, Tingle statue. Oh man. Are you kidding? Okay. Thank you. Oh my god, I'm underneath the flower. All right. Get up there. Get up there, Link. What is wrong with you? Use your brain, kid. Your brain, son. And now we can just sail down the murky, dirty sea. Inside the Deku Tree. Okay, well, this actually isn't inside the Deku Tree. It's for, for Forbidden Woods. But we, we are in kind of, you know, a tree. What if... What if the Forbidden Woods was actually the remains of the dead Deku Tree? After all... It did have water in that dungeon, and it was a tree, just like how, sorry, you know, this is kind of a tree. Even though it's called Forbidden Woods. Oh my god. Oh, and, and I'm just saying, you know, like, we had to crash through, you know, something to get into the basement in this dungeon. It's like we had to crash through a web in the Deku Tree to get to the basement there. This could be the dead Deku Tree. And I guess, uh... Um, the uh, Dragon Roost Cavern that could have been like the the um, Death Mountain from uh, the game Ocarina of Time there we go okay so yeah it appears we are trapped in here but you know it's nothing major you know you just want to go up here and then use your boomerang to get all five these not that hard of a room and link is looking up there all right whatever just give me my boss key or big key I'm sorry I'm sorry We're, we gotta be proper here folks okay so we got that we're doing good we're doing good And we got some Moblin reinforcements. I like how Carterox just, you know, drop them down for no- Oh, wait. They're not dead. Okay, I want to pick this up because I forgot they actually are good in hand-to-hand -hand combat. <laughs> I love the AI in this game, by the way. Like, But the funniest thing ever is when these enemies can't find their main weapon. So they just pick up a different enemy's weapon. Like, seeing a Moblin use a Boca Blend sword is like the most amazing thing ever. <laughs> okay. And the skull necklace, why not? Hey. 
And now... How the hell do I get out of here? Oh, wait. I think I always forget about this. Yeah. Alright. So, yeah. The rest of this dungeon... Fairly linear as we make our way back. Green choo-choos everywhere. Why? I know I'm leaving that green jelly behind, but holy crap, I think I'm already at freaking 20. Like, how, how much do I have? Let me check my spoils bag. 18. Wow, I, I have, like, far too many green jelly. Or maybe not enough green jelly. Did I ever think about that? No, I didn't. No, I didn't. I'm horrible. Because I didn't think about that. Alright, whatever. Anyway, we can spend that right there. And then we can go up. We can attempt to... We can attempt to go up in here. I'm just gonna wait. I'm just gonna be incredibly stupid. We can do that, and then we can jump in here, and then we can go out like that, and then glide, and then updraft. All right, are we good? I think we're good. Okay, we're good. Alrighty, there's no time to waste, but I'm wasting quite a lot of it. Barely see. Mothulas! Wingless Mothulas at that, so. Freaking annoying enemies. Yeah. Well, that was. That was easy. Huh. I was expecting a little more of that. I was expecting invisible things, too. Like thorns coming out of the ground. Joy pendant. Ugh, uh, man. Yeah. Nah! Joy Pen, yeah! No! Yeah, I'm just walking with these things because I don't care. Link don't care. Link don't give an F. So how many will I be leaving behind for when I come back? One and two. Okay, I'm leaving two treasures behind. That's that's cool. It's fine. I can I can live with that. I won't lose sleep. No! God darn it! Freaking green chews, you're annoying! Die! A thousand deaths! Oh my god, no. And let's see, I still have a fairy in the bottle, right? Yeah, and I don't have a second bottle, so... This will do. Oh, crap. Ah, crap. Okay, and then we have that right there uh, might as well I don't anticipate me dying on this boss but whatever you know just unlock it why not okay mm, and I could like just break the rest of these looking for fairies and stuff but like I said I don't anticipate myself dying on this boss and you don't even need magic power for it so let's go Oh, wait, 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 wait. Uh, will this work? I'm, I'm not sure if this will work, though. Uh, I don't know if this will count as Makar or the boss. No, this, no, this will probably just count as Makar. Uh, all right, fine. Yeah, that's Makar. And that's the boss. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing... I, I have no clue if, I, if I'm pronouncing this right. I don't think I've... I have never heard anybody say this boss's name out loud. So, uh, we're fighting Kali Demos or Kali Demos. Kali Demos. I don't know, but whatever. Kind of reminds me of Baronade a bit. But, you know, whatever. Okay, so... Oh, that counts? 
That counts? Thought you had to get its little head thing. Uh, all right, whatever. Anyway, you just want to run until like it has its little tentacles preoccupied with some. Oh crap! Yeah, what you want to do is just attack the tendrils it has that are holding it up. This can get rather hectic, but it's fairly simple. I am wasting far too much time getting rid of these tendrils, though. Really? One left? Okay. And just for good measure... Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna believe in good faith that that good will count. For, uh, the Kali Damas figurine, so, uh, yeah. Because you have, like, no time to take a picture of the head. I really thought that's what you had to take a picture of. Okay, before they respawn. Really? It's always one. Alright, whatever, anyway, let's be serious about this. Okay, because, yeah, when you do that, you just want to run in there and, you know, hit it. This is all there is to the boss fight, by the way. There's, like, no second phase like there was with Goma. In a way, it's kind of easier than Goma. Or she. I don't even know what the hell this thing is. Yeah, you can use your shield to block those uh, vines that are trying to kill you, but... It's easier to just run. Really? Two left? Oh, wow, this is not going well. And this is one of my better boss fights, actually. Like, oh my god. If I would have hit that jump attack, it, it would have been over. It's on the verge of death. It has, like, no HP whatsoever. <laughs> Alright. Come on. Did it hit anything? This is just so embarrassing. Like, this boss should not be taking me this much trouble. Like, I'm not even trying to take a picture at this point. I'm just... Whatever, it's dead. I really hope that picture of its bulb will suffice. Or just, just like the overarching thing. Because, uh, yeah, if I needed a picture of its head, that probably wasn't going to work out. I probably shouldn't have wasted time trying to zoom in, actually. Okay, Swordsman, are you want to rescue me? Yes, I am, because there's no one else here. You're welcome, by the way. When all went dark around me, I thought my time on Earth was over. But why are you here, Swordsman? What? The Great Decatree sent you? Oh, that's right. That's the day of our annual ceremony. I'm in trouble. I shouldn't be here. I must get out of here immediately. Speaking of getting out of here immediately, I kind of need to do that, too, because, holy crap, I have 27 minutes to get to work. Ah, uh, so, yeah, all right, come on. Uh, Makar, follow Link through the portal. And we're right here, conveniently. Yes, he has returned safely. Sorry, Great Deku Tree, I know you warned us many times, but still I did not listen. Do not worry, Makar, you are safe now. Just be careful from now on. You have done well, Link. I must thank you for all your brave deeds. Here is that which I have promised you. Please accept it. At least this time he's nice enough to drop it down to us. <coughs> Shh. 
Strike a pose, Link, because you have Feror's Pearl. The Earth Spirit of the Deku Tree has seen fit to give you this jewel, a treasure of the goddess Feror. Feror? Ferori? I don't know. It's my hope that this pearl shall lead you to a fair destiny. All is well, Makar. Do not cry. Please, play your songs for me as you always do. Oh, well, that's right. We must begin our ceremony soon, before the day ends. I'm sorry to keep you all waiting. Let the ceremony begin. Oh, great, Link. It's my thanks to you. I shall play even harder than I normally do. Hope you enjoy it. We still don't even know what this ceremony is, but I mean, hey, you know, it's, it's just there. Link's face! Great Decatree, this year you have once again produced some splendid seeds. With these seeds, we'll continue to spread new forests across the Great Sea. Let us go, Karaks, to the sea. See you all next year. Take care. Farewell, great swordsman. The winds of champs bring us together again someday. Silence. But yeah, they're going around the great sea to plant seeds to make even bigger and better forests. Though, considering the islands where you're going to find them, they uh, kind of had the wrong idea. And I love how whenever you come here from now on, like, Makar will just be sitting here playing his music. I just like it. I just like it for some reason. But alright, uh, that's gonna end things here. I really need to be on my way now, but first things first, we're gonna go ahead and talk to Kangi to figure out where we need to go to next. And yeah, we'll just let the currents guide us. Because I'm lazy like that. Am I alive? Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm like, wait, what's going on here? Where am I? I was right there the whole time. I was never in trouble, and we have mail! I assume it's for us. I mean, you know, it was shaking. Letters for Link, we have one letter. Here's your letter. <laughs> Dear Link, if you're reading this letter, it can only mean you have peeked into one of our many post boxes. I'm indebted to you. I'm very sorry I let you leave without thanking you. Please accept my heartfelt apology along with my thanks. We cannot do much to help you, but we can at least do this. If we get any letters or parcels for you, we'll deliver them to a post box near you. How would you know where I am? If you see any wiggling post boxes, please look inside them. I suppose you have a long way to go before your perilous journey is done. I've included a gift for you with my letter in the hope that it might help you. Please accept the small token. I look forward to the day we meet again. May fortune fill your wings from Kamali's father. Ooh, a heart piece. That is very helpful. Thank you. Is that actually the first heart piece I've collected in this entire game? Yes, it is the first heart piece I've collected. Wow, okay. And yeah, you can't check your um, Wind Waker songs on this menu, can you? Huh, that's weird. Okay, well, whatever. Anyway, Kingy, talk to me. So this place too has already been attacked by Ganon. Could he already be regaining his power? Yeah. Link, you must get the remaining pearl. It, li it lies in a place northwest of here. We must sail immediately. Northwest? That is the name of Kanye West's baby. Why would they name her, like, really, why, why would they just name her North? I mean, yeah, you know, it's, it's a funny joke, haha, -ha, but wow, she's going to be made fun of a lot in classes. But, all right, we're not dwelling on that. We're dwelling on this outro. So, next time, we're going to go to an island northwest of here. So, thank you all for watching. Have a great day. See you next time for some more Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. Let me go ahead and change the wind now before I uh, forget. And then it was already facing northwest. All right, whatever. I was already there. Might as well just let that play again. All right, goodbye, everybody.